Somebody call the law. Somebody call the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though? Heist man, the foe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. We is back at it once again, man. Talking about blood in, blood out. One of my favorite movies of all time, man. Um, I did a video not too long ago, man. Last week, I did it about Big Al, man. I just want to, you know, put the people on to what I like looking at, man. And Blood In, Blood Out is one of my favorite movies of all time. And Big Al is one of my favorite characters, man. But this time, we're going to talk about another character, man. Popeye. Popeye Saavedra. If y'all don't know Popeye, man, he one of the grimiest and funniest people in Blood In, Blood Out, man. The funniest characters. Um, he grimy though, man. He real grimy. If y'all don't know who he is, he one of the founding seven. Um, by the looks of this picture, you would think he the top guy, number one head guy. Um, but he not, man. That's the um lie on the council. He's gonna get out of jail, man. He wanted to take a picture, man. This is um what do you call it? It's my it's my um parole picture. That's what he called it. But he a big um he part of the um seven. Um if y'all know this movie, man, y'all, this is a dope picture right here, actually, man. Seeing all these guys together for this shot right here for this movie. That's dope, man. That's epic, yo. But, uh, he, um, he grind me and, um, we're gonna talk about Popeye in a second, but, um, he got one of the best dialogues in the movie that I like, man. Like, everything he say is like a, a good one-liner. He always got something to say. It just sound good, man. Like, when he got caught by the police and, um, he seen Paco's tattoo on his hand he said you should be riding with me and not fucking with me cardinal <laughs> he didn't say stuff like that man he got all type of things man did he say one-liners yo? if you go look it up on youtube man look up like um blood in blood out best lines or quotes and he gonna be up there a lot man because he got a lot of stuff to say um he grimy though man he grimy one of the grimiest things he did he wouldn't try to sell his boy some dope um not sell it to him he tried to give him to him um, Smokey, he rolled up on a hey, smokes, and he gave me like a um a, a big um like a cigar box full of PCP laced cigars or something. He like they dipped t twice for you, <laughs> and like he gonna give them to him, but he tried to stab him, man. Like he ah for cheap times or something like that, man. And yo, look at that knife, man. He had a big ass knife, it was about that long, man, but. Like I said, he one of the funniest and grimiest characters, man, for just the things he say. So we're going to get into this right now, man. Some of this um, Popeye Saavedra's um, best one-liners. This, this is my favorite part of him, man. When he first got introdu introduced to the movie, when they went to jail, San Quentin. For a long time. Hola, pretty. Aren't you blind all over? Get your hands off me. His blue eyes just light right up when he get mad. Where the fuck you get that plucker, little bo -peep? Hey Cinderella, go find yourself a fella. You're on the clock, bitch, and midnight is coming. Soy Popeye. Yo, pimp. Conoces a mi carnalito, Chuey Saavedra? El Chuy? Chuy? It's mi carnal. What's your problem, man? Hey, I ain't got no problem, brother. Hold on, hold on, fight! That's a fucking fine comb you got. You should give it to one of my bitches. Yes. Watch your mouth, sucker. Right. Put your spear down, punk <laughs> You know this comb has power, sucker. Yeah. Black power. Yeah. Right, right on. Power to give a fool like you nightmares. Yeah. So you won't understand that. Ain't nothing to me, I say. Yeah, I know it. I'm about finished waiting for my money, punk. Hey, why not take it out in trade? You always like Tinkerbell. She's fine. You bet Make cash, you lose cash, you pay cash. Pimp mobile. <laughs> Maybe you'd like to swap for some of that tender white meat. You can pay your bets with that. Suave, Al. You're the sucker that does the spider. Well, if a rep is what you're looking for, killer, then I'm the man you want. Just puntos like spider. Tres like spider. Ooh, I'm the boogeyman. He pissed in his pants. What's the onda? Some questions you don't ask. Got a little something else. Some juju. <laughs> I smoke that now, what the hell? White bitch, give me some chon chon. Try, give it up. Ah, la quieres las dudas, sir? You want me to take it? Huh? You want me to rape you, eh, puto? Huh? That's it. Pippi don't belong in la onda. It's low class. Keep your horse in the rec room. 
motherfucker. Yeah, man, that's like, that's what they allow me to show right now, man. I tried to do this video a couple times, man. And um, YouTube is not, a, I don't really want me showing this this movie or parts of this movie. Um, the way they clipped it like that, it, it don't really give you the whole gist of um, Popeye. But man, he grimy. He got so many one-liners and things he say, man. He just, he just a funny character, man, in this movie, man. Y'all should go check this out, yo. This is the one of the greatest movies of all time. Underrated film, man. Blood in, blood out, bound by honor. I think I'm gonna do, um, I don't know, cause I like doing this, man. I see the feedback that this channel getting about blood in, blood out, and it's like, it's like a passion project, man. It was easy to do this. I, when I just put it up, it was like, man, I need something to do today. So why not just talk about Big Al, you know, Blood In, Blood Out. Just because I know the movie, I've seen it a thousand times. And I put it up, it got a couple hundred views. I'm like, oh shit, y'all like this? Y'all want to hear me talk about Blood In, Blood Out? So I can talk about it all day because I know it. That's why it's like a passion project. I can just talk about it. It ain't like, what up though, Ice Man the Four, blah, 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 blah. I talk about the news and stuff like that. So I like doing this, man. But um, I think I'm going to do um, Spider next. Show some of his scenes because Spider, he like the first person to let me know this was a gangster movie. Um, some of his dialogue he had because y'all don't know this movie. This is like a, it's like a hood movie. It ain't like it's for everybody, man. It's it's a Latino classic, but it's a hood movie, man. I just love it, yo. I'm gonna be definitely gonna be checking this out. I mean, um, doing more content about this, man. Because you should be writing with me, not fucking with me, Cardinal. It just—it's a movie about family, man. If you um go back and look at this movie or anything about it, know anything about it, it all has to do with family, man. And um, not like um Fast and the Furious, not like it's all about family, like Vin Diesel. This is about a good family movie. Between all this other stuff, it's like people go this way, people go that way. Great movie, man. Y'all should check it out. I go live on the channel every Friday at 9 p.m. talking about stuff just like this. You got to come through and highlight at me, man. Put in the um, comment section what you think about this movie or what are the parts you, should I be talking about or your favorite part. Tell me your favorite part about this movie because there's a lot of people who love Blood In, Blood Out, man. Y'all just tell me who y'all favorite character is. What's y'all favorite part? Um, who got wronged? How you think it should have ended? Did you like the ending? This is... I don't know, man. Y'all just tell me what y'all think about this, man. But like I said, I go live on the channel every Friday at 9 p.m. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you got to hit to get this pimping that I'm putting out when I put it out. Like I said, I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through, holler at your boy, Heist Man the Foe. Talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions. This is a dangerous group, is it? groups that we're dealing with now. All right. This time, but I'll be back. And sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there.